Scientists say nuclear fusion, the same process that powers the sun, to be sure, could potentially provide a limitless amount of clean energy for everyone forever. But they also say recreating the sun is very hard. For the past few decades, people have joked that fusion energy is always 20 years away. But scientists at DeepMind say they've created an artificial intelligence that would substantially improve the process. Anthony's Don Ma tells us how. Searching for a better form of energy, many bet nuclear fusion, the same process that powers the sun, could be the answer. They see it as a potentially clean, safe, and limitless form of power. And now, deep mind scientists have collaborated with the Swiss Plasma Center to create artificial intelligence that controls nuclear fusion. What they've achieved is something that no one has achieved before. Damien Ernst is a professor at the University of Liege in Belgium. Ernst says fusion is extremely difficult and that this is a big breakthrough. Fusion involves using heat and pressure to combine atomic nuclear nuclei, which creates energy-generating plasma. DeepMind used its AI to run simulations of this in a tokamak, a donut-shaped machine that confines the plasma with magnets. In order to stop the plasma touching the edges of this donut, there are very tiny micro changes required to the 19 magnets that sit around this donut. Harry Saeed is the founder of Silvered I.O. Saeed says this is where AI comes in. This plasma is spinning around at phenomenal speeds, at over 150 million degrees Celsius, which is even hotter than the sun. And if the plasma touches the ends or the surface of that donut, then we have a problem. However, despite the progress, nuclear fusion hasn't been successful for decades. What we haven't been successful at is achieving a fusion reaction that uh, gives us net gain energy efficiency. Right now, when we uh, create a plasma, when we do fusion science, uh, we put one unit of energy in and we only get a third of that energy out. Sean Kenny is the host of YouTube show Rock Logic. Kenny says the goal is to get far more energy out then goes in. The joke about fusion is, for the last 67 years, 68 years, fusion has always been 20 years in the future. Is this uh, an experiment to show that time doesn't exist in modern physics? Paul Dorfman is an associate fellow at the University of Sussex. Dorfman is skeptical we'll ever have fusion energy. Despite this, Big names have poured billions into private fusion companies. Examples include Commonwealth Fusion Systems, which is backed by Google and Bill Gates. Commonwealth recently announced it raised $1.8 billion in Series B funding. Helion, which is backed by Facebook co-founder Dustin Moskovitz and LinkedIn co-founder Reid Hoffman, recently announced it secured $2.2 billion in Series E funding. And Tri Alpha Energy, which is collaborating with Google, which also owns DeepMind. TA versus anybody else, I'm confident because they're taking a totally different tact than the tokamak. Larry Albuquerque is a managing partner at EB Exchange. Albuquerque has invested in Tri Alpha Energy and is confident about its proprietary technology. They've hit these milestones every step of the way for over 20 years. If they can raise the temperature a little bit more, they'll they should be in a position uh, where they can prove net positive energy out. Alpkirk, Erst, and Saeed believe we may see usable fusion energy in around 10 years. Don Ma, NTD News.